I don't know when the final word actually come out. Mm -hmm. um, I really have no clue. Probably next Tuesday, mm -hmm. I don't know, but I mean, it looking like I'm really eligible this year, so I'm gonna prepare myself for the season. And I'm just be ready. Did uh, did focusing on academics over the summer take away any of your focus on football and, and working out that you normally would or any, anything like that? I mean, a little bit. I mean, because last year, I was, I, I mean, I took academics seriously, but I was focused more on football, and then it slipped out of my hands, and I, was, I lost a whole, a whole season. So, so this year, I focused mostly on academics to make sure I was put myself in a good position to make to make grades to play football this year. Is it one of those things where even if it hurts you a little bit, you know, you need to do it just because, right? If you weren't, you know, if you're not eligible, it doesn't matter how good you are on the football field, right? Yeah, I mean, that's, I'm here to play football, and uh, that's one of the things you gotta do. You gotta get your academic straight to play football. So, I focus more on that because I know I can do the football part. Are you uh, are you starting to get tired of people asking you about about how you've changed as a person since you got here and everything like that? I mean, it's kind of like the obvious thing with you now, but you know, is there going to be a time where you want you want to stop talking about how hey, I was different when I was a freshman, now I'm a junior? Uh, I mean, it, it comes with the territory, I guess, from, especially when you lose a season due to grades. I mean, I, how often does that happen? So mm -hmm. I mean, like you say, I mean, it, it takes growing up to it takes maturity to get things straight and ask. I mean, I'm prepared for the questions pretty much. When you walk into class, do you tell your professor, I'm here to play football, or do you just keep that between us? <laughs> <laughs> no, I just, I just tell the professor, I introduce myself to the professor, and, uh, pretty much, I just tell the professor who I am, and um, I'm just, I just want to have a good semester in their class. That's pretty much it. I don't really tell them I'm on the football team enough, I just tell them who I am, pretty much. What, what was the last class you had to take? I took a, um, um, guitar class. Guitar? Uh, yeah, I took I took anthro, I took anthro class, and I took a guitar class. I've got other class I took that let me get my GPA, my GPA up to pay up, pay for more. Which is all the, the one you were waiting for now? Was there one you were waiting for now, last grade? Uh, I think it was a guitar class, but I think I'm, I'm make that, so I'll be fine. Pretty much. You had talked about it coming out of the spring. You felt pretty good. Was it just about getting your GPA up? You were good on. Like the core units. Yeah, stuff. my core. I had to get my GPA up, um, so I pretty much took one elective, which is with car to, to help my GPA, so I'd be able to play football. Does it give you more confidence to know that you can take care of that grade stuff now? I mean, does it affect you at all? Is it you know in terms of a person like the fact that you get that you know GPA above would, the minimum? Like, Say it again. Are you more confident when, when you have you know when you know you can get a B or an A in a class and, and move yourself up to GPA? And you come to the football field more confident then? Would you say? Uh, yeah. I mean. Like I said, I took a, I took a lot of hard classes, and uh, it's only gonna get harder because next year I'm only I have to take all my uh, all my major classes. So um, I mean I'm better prepared. I got better skills now. I know what to do. I know how to go how to approach my work, and I'll just be ready for the semester.